power of 10 negative exponent we're asked to evaluate 10 to the negative seventh and there's a pattern and a bit of a shortcut that we can use to to help us since we're only dealing with a power of 10. Uh, if we have 10 raised to the negative 1 for example we have a 1 that is one place behind the decimal so 0.1 would be 10 to the negative 1. 10 to the negative 2 would still be the 1, but this time it would be two places behind the decimal. And the pattern continues. 10 to the negative 3rd would be the 1, but this time it would have to be three places behind the decimal. Be careful uh, that you're not counting those zeros. We're counting the number of places that the one is behind the decimal. And since we need some fillers, that's why the zeros come in. So for our example here of 10 to the negative seventh, that's also going to be a one behind the decimal. But since the one needs to be seven places behind the decimal, I'm actually going to have to put in some zeros and in this case I need six of them so that I can now have the one seven places behind the zero and just to count that's one two three four five six seven the one is seven places behind the zero